Oh, hey, Tripp. I'm Tyler, and I'm 20, and I'm calling from Oregon. What's up, Tyler? What's your question? Okay. So there's this girl that I work with. Yes. Um, like I've known her for a couple years and like at first I didn't, um, at first I didn't, um, feel attracted to her, but over the years, you know, like I started to develop feelings for her and, and, you know, I, like I heard about the workplace and everything and how it can be a little bit risky and everything. Very risky. Like I, I know, Extremely risky. Yeah, I know all that. And high risk, so Tyler, just, high risk. Yeah. Like, and I know the risk and everything. I just like, but, but you um, don't care. Do you? Like she just, yeah, she just seems, she just seems really cool, t- funny and teases me a lot and, in the joking way. That's just part of her personality. And, and I just want to see if, just see what she's like outside of the workplace and, um, you know, try and make it casual. And so do you think that about. there are other cool girls out there outside the workplace? Sorry, what was that? Do you think that there are other women out there outside the workplace who are cool and interesting and pretty and fun? Um, yeah, there is, but, um, like, I have done some approaching, but it's just, um, I have done approaching, but, you know, it's just, I don't know, it's just about this girl, but, of course, uh, I probably need to why keep is looking. It, why but, is it worth the risk? Right. Why is it worth um, this? Is this is why is it? I, I know what you're gonna say, but my question is: is why is it worth the risk when there are other women out there? I get it. I get it. It's easy. It's right there. That's why people go for women in the workplace because it's right there. It's like inches away from them, but it's a very mm-hmm. high risk. If you guys, first of all, there's a risk of sexual harassment. There's a risk mm-hmm. of if you guys even get together and then you break up, you're going to have to spend eight hours a day or four hours a day if you work part-time, whatever, with this person that you broke up with. Your life is going to be miserable. There is nothing to gain from dating someone in the workplace. And there's and I know there's an argument out there that says, uh, but lots of people do it. And how else am I supposed to meet women? Because there's so many women here. It's like it's... It's so easy. It's right there, and other people do it. Doesn't make it right. Tyler, right. you're 20. You're young, my friend. Are you in school? Uh, yes, sir. Okay. Focus on your school. Focus on your schoolwork. Do your job. Focus on that. When you graduate and you have focused on your school, get a great job, and then come back to the whole dating scene where you're going to be doing a bunch of approaching. I don't know if you're going to listen to me or not. You may take this advice. You may not. But just understand, the risk is higher than you think. It's not worth it in the end. It's not. Plus, you're young. Sure. And, the, and, and I'm not trying to be negative here, but just I'm, I'm 34, so I have some years on you from experience. And I just mm-hmm. know from statistics, most relationships don't work out. You got to mm-hmm. think, that even the ones that get to marriage, 50%, at least in America, uh, which you are in, 50% end in divorce. So you can imagine how many relationships even get to that point, right? So I'm not saying don't get into a relationship. By all means, I'm very into that concept. That's why I do what I do. But um, but just know that because it's so slim, it's probably not going to work out with her anyways. So even that is another argument for you to be able to go for someone else in a safer environment. So true. <clears throat> that's my answer, my friend. Okay. 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 Yeah, sure. Yeah, that's great. Uh, thank you. I, I appreciate that. Thanks, Tyler. Thanks for calling me, man. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. And just uh, thank you for everything you do. I've been watching for you for a while, and yeah, just keep doing what you do. Keep doing uh, what you're doing. Bro. I appreciate that. You're very welcome. Thank you. Okay. Have a good one. Bye bye.